I want to do a review of this Bluetooth speaker that is good for uh, camping and in general just taken wherever you want to go I mean you can move it to a room of the house your bedroom the garage um, since we all you know have a cell phone and uh, they usually have Bluetooth capability you can connect to these little portable speaker sound boxes and uh, I mean you can put it in your backpack you can carry it in your hand you know like I said the garage living room den um, and that's kind of where I started using it at was in these places generally in my garage because I don't have a you know stereo besides my phone on me and uh, what I like about these you you just charge them up you know you keep them on the charger doesn't take long to charge the uh, rechargeable battery up in them and you don't you never have to replace the batteries uh, I think I've had this for about a year a year and a half maybe two years I might have had it for two years and I, I never used it that much and uh, I think it was like 60 it's about sixty dollars on uh, eBay I think I think I bought it on eBay and uh, it was I think it was an open box I can't remember if it was new or an open box um, I think just somebody was just trying to sell it and get rid of it because they never used it but I found this to be very handy um, while I'm traveling in my truck and uh, I was thinking about it a little bit more and I thought that it would be good to have if you don't if you don't want to run a stereo or maybe you don't have a stereo or maybe you just have like a cheap AM FM radio in your vehicle right now and you don't want to spend you know $150 buying you know like a speaker box for the behind your seat and a stereo deck you know that has you know high wattage so you can get you know qu good quality sound but uh, you know they also drain the battery you know your 12 volt car stereos you know running a powerful speaker box you know you're running 50 watts you know and, and a large uh, couple speakers you know you're draining your battery and a lot of people run their stereo when they, they turn their engine off you know too they still leave it running so it's, it's always a battery drain you know and uh, these are really nice because you know you just you just charge them up you know like me I charge mine in my garage and then when I'm ready to go I just throw it in in the in the truck and I usually just keep it right here I think this is what it looks like so you turn it on and it turns on got a little blue some blue lights there that flash while the music's playing also and I just lay it up here on my dash just like that turn it off on a little longer hold that button a little longer and it has really good sound it's high fidelity very powerful it's kind of like it's a lot like a Bose uh, a Bose stereo I mean it's a lot like it sounds a lot like a Bose stereo it's it's really good sound and it's heavy you know it weighs probably three and a half three pounds probably about three pounds somewhere around there so it's got good quality components in it good sound and, and I don't have to use my stereo and I can play any song that I want to because you know how you can never 
you can never find the right song on the radio. Um, you usually you have to have CDs or run Bluetooth, you know, from your phone. And I don't have Bluetooth on this stereo, so uh, I can play any song that I want to from my phone, YouTube, you know, I can whatever I want. And so, for sixty bucks, portable, doesn't drain your battery. Um, you don't have to, it's really easy to turn on, you just push the button, you know, and it's on. You just have to set your cell phone to Bluetooth, which, you know, isn't hard. You know, it could be, you've got a dashboard on your phone that has the Bluetooth button on it. You don't even have to go into settings, you know. Like my phone, you know, I'm running, I have a Sony, I'm running a Sony Xperia. So I've got the dashboard features right there. Uh, on the screen, I just you know slide the screen down, and there's my buttons. So it's real easy. Uh, remote access, and yeah, I, I really like it. And this is the uh, no, before I forget. Um, this is a VR3. Let me see, VR3 VR650. That's the model. VR3 VR650. And, uh, yeah, I really like it, and uh, that's, I just wanted to, you know, kind of talk about it. I guess a little truck talk, you know, a little accessory for the truck, you know, for anybody who's interested. All right, I'll talk to you later, and you guys have a great day. Enough said.